Tigers Orioles first of three Victor's gonna be the man I hope you're right on the road to the red bit badge what is how many how many bits is the red bit badge that's that's a, a ton isn't it 11 and 5 versus 9 and 8 second straight series versus the American League East um like I said, I don't particularly like the Baltimore Orioles, so I'd like to take it to him here. And Jordan Zimmerman will get the start, his fourth of the season. And he's been really good. Been really good. One no decision mixed in there, but his ERA is under two. Who's number two for bits? Uh, Timo. Timo Quinton, who is who's been hanging around the last couple days, with ten. <laughs> All right. First pitch low on who is this? Who is this leading off? Austin Hayes. I have no idea who this is. Oh, I'm so used to road to the show. I need to pitch. I need to pitch uh, regularly again. Ooh, good slider there. Zim slider's been really, really good so far this year. 48 degrees, blowing from left field to right field. So opposite field shots could be the way to go today for home runs. Just missed. Can I mute my mic yet? No, I, I'm going to have to mute my microphone from my computer, not my, uh, not my stream deck today. Well, that's unfortunate. Change up will fall in there. While we're uh, while we have uh, time here in the beginning, let's take a look at our bullpen today. And for the first time, really, in what feels like a week, uh, we have a bullpen that can get us through some innings. Really, for the first time since that twenty-two inning game. Down the line, foul made good contact on a slider that we half missed on. Swing and a miss of the changeup. Should have taken a little bit off of that pitch, I think. But it worked out. First strikeout. Did take six pitches. But Austin Hayes will sit. I have exactly two bits remaining. I have. I, I bought the 500 bits for 99 cents, man. Amazon Prime is so great. Trey Mancini, Manny Machado will be the bats that we see. Guaranteed here in this first inning. Slept too much. Is it possible to sleep too much? Fouled off. Ah, aren't taxes lovely? Swing and a miss. Good two seamer down and in from Zim. All right, he has seen. Fastball, fastball, change up. He's getting the slider right here. Man, I, I missed with it. I didn't time that up well. All right, change up, taking a lot off of it. On the ground, going to have to be a good play. Iglesias jump throw. Woo! Oh, baby. Oh, Jose Iglesias with the Jeter jump throw from left field. Hello. Is there a... Uh, is there, are there pick the stick points for tremendous defensive plays? Because that was it. That was one of them. That was an incredible play. God, Heem is right. Shot foul, 101. Um, this is a guy we can't really make a mistake to, obviously. Manny Machado. <sighs> oh, and we did. And we did. He took a ball inside the opposite way. And then a bad throw. But luckily, Iglesias there to cut it off. Uh, I don't know how he hit this ball that hard down the line. I'm pretty sure that ball was in. Just a, I don't even know if it was a great piece of hitting or not, or if he was just late on that ball. I don't know. You don't know how to make coffee in a coffee maker. What? 
How the hell have you ever drank coffee? I, I want to know how he did this. What? That doesn't make sense at all. Unless this is off the end of the bat. I don't, I, I don't know. Lovely physics on that one. Here's Chris Davis now. And now it's Crush. Crush Davis, a.k.a. Chris. In the air, center field. Martin should be able to get that. And he will. So a two-out double to Manny Machado in one of the weirdest bits of physics that I think we've seen this year. But uh, it is stranded after the fly ball by Davis. So I finally did get the, the, the Jackie Robinson Day uh, hat. I wasn't really all that impressed with the patch. Like, it's literally just like a piece of plastic, like, glued to the hat. It just feels lazy to me. I, like, it's not even, not even, like, shiny or anything. It's not even cool. All right, Leonis Martin with his 095 batting average stands in. Yeah, that 095 is bad. It is really bad. It's the kind of it's the time of day at Comerica Park when the uh, sun is shining like right on the batter's eye, the bushes in center, and I can't really I, I don't see the ball well here in the first couple innings in games like this. Only three pitches for their starter today, so generally we do very well against these guys. Leonis Martin will fly out left field. Or just laid on that ball or something. Not really sure. And his average gets worse. Up next is Jamer Candelario, who's batted well lately. And Miguel Cabrera, 0 for 7. What? 0 for 7 last month. He was 0 for 7 in March. I guess that is technically true. That just seems like a weird stat. He was 0 for 7 last month. Went with two games. Where is Dixon? He's not batting today. We started Nico Goodrum at second. I think I was a little bit early on that. <laughs> that tied me up. 0-2. Pick it, ball boy. Check your email. You send me talking points so I can actually know what we're talking about on the podcast this week before you before we start it. <laughs> um, change up. Ooh, that was stone cold take right there. I thought, I thought that bad things were about to happen to us. Oh, tits. Okay. Well, here's Miguel. Planning, I know. It's okay. Or it's, uh, it, 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 it's, it's a great thing. I don't even know the last time my family went on a vacation. Like we go on, we go on a lot like a little trips. Evil's predicting an O for day for Miggy. We will take that easily. Base hit. Just squared up. And there's Nick Castellanos. And this is what we're talking about. He's been in just this terrible slump. One for 17. Which is almost impossible to do. An 0.59 batting average. Which is atrocious. It's terrible. 
Hit hard, but not deep enough. And that'll end the inning. Two out hits for both teams, but no damage done in the first. Has the makings of one of those. Hola. Hola, Mr. Vince. Yeah, 059 is just, it's crazy bad. Jonathan Scope will lead off the second. I kind of dig those multi, the, the Baltimore socks, though. The stance socks. Those are pretty sweet. I like those. Like, you know, those are just, those just look nice. Whereas some of them are literally just socks with the team logo on the side. Like, it. What? How? Why? Aloha. Don't tell me. Don't tell me you're in Hawaii right now, man. I'm in Antarctica. Still. Gonna go foul. Take a little bit off this change up down and away. God, I can't, I can't, I'm, I'm throwing a lot of pitches right now. This is not, this is not great. I don't even know. I have no clue. Hardly missed my timing and that pitch just hooked. Uh, and they have a base runner for Adam Jones. Come on, game. Let's go. Leonis Martin on the line makes the catch. Time for a look at the, Tigers on D. <sighs> the built in walk. Here's Tim Beckham. That ball was hung. Slider fouled off. Oh and one. Uh, let's get some control in these pitches. God damn it! Why? Like it's I I I don't know. What is our ratio right now? It's probably shit. Thirteen balls, fifteen strikes. This is terrible. There we go. Apparently, I just have to throw it right down the middle to get a strike. I don't know. There we go. Ah, we're throwing a lot of pitches though. Thirty pitches, and we don't even—we're not even out of the second inning. It's a good thing we have a bullpen again. Seventy-eight degrees over here. I don't even know what the temperature is right now here. Colby Rasmus is on the O's. When did that happen? Yeah, right. My my ratio is about fifty-fifty. Not good. One on one here. Rasmus way early on the change. There we go. Finally timed up the slider again. If that when we're timing that pitch up, we can uh, we can definitely make something happen with that. I don't know how we I don't know how we got away with that. Michigan sucks balls. What the, the just the state in general? And our awful weather. Victor Martinez. Hit a home run for us in the, uh, I believe, in the Yankee series. Yeah, he yeah he hit a home run in that series. Sun still shining bright on the bushes in center field. So this, this inning might be a little rough. Time to load the bases for Jose. Would that, would that be a thing? Hit this ball, Oppo. Or he doubles down on a change. Because of course he does. Oh, wait, no, he threw the slider the first time. Even slower. Oh, don't you dare. I didn't go. What? 
says the third base umpire. He's gone. Okay. No. Uh-uh. I refuse to believe that. I refuse to believe that I went around on that. Uh, borderline. I won't get too upset on that one. It was because I, I power swung and it's... <laughs> I, I power swung and it's almost impossible to hold back a swing on those. And that's it on the ground to Manny Machado. Not going to miss a uh, mistake. Make a mistake on that one. Oh, we got a challenge here? Not Ron Gardenhire thinks he wants to take a look at it. What do we got here? Manny did come up really slow on this. Oh my! What? Ron, you drunk? Not even close. There we go. Two out hits is a rough way to make a living and a rough uh, way to have a good have a good game, but uh, two two out hits to this point in the game. Returned for making dinner. How did you return? I think this is the first time you were in here, unless I didn't see you, which is hard because I'm pretty sure you're the only one with their name in blue here. Or am I wrong? Let's scroll. Oh, no, he was here. Yeah, he said to check. He told me to check my email. Yep, that's, I'm wrong. Jose Iglesias, Evo's picker. Yes, yes, I figured it out. Down low fastball. Uh, I just, uh, literally, I hate Comerica Park at this time of day. It's almost impossible to see the ball coming out of the pitcher's hand. Change up, maybe? Well, you find yourself in a two -two count right here. Interested to see what up the middle, that's going to be an easy flip on to second. Again, two out hits, rough way to win games. But luckily, our pitching is uh, doing its job so far. Welcome in, Crispy Breath. I did say that right, right? Yes. Yeah. We'll, uh, we'll get the offense going. Once we're able to see the ball better. We're, uh, we're having a good day. Uh, we're having a good day, Crispy. Uh, ooh, okay. Yeah, it was not a negative, just a ground out. They have eyes like gods. Okay. There we go. Sim's got a couple strikeouts already. Take that. Three pitches, all three down in the zone. So now you've got a guy that's sinking something down around the knee. Uh, Carlito, we play a little bit of Diamond Dynasty. Pretty much only on off days on franchise or when I have a lot of time. Uh, main, mainly we focus on franchise and road to the show. I like, uh, I like Battle Royale a little bit more than, um, than just playing straight up ranked events in DD. The shorter games makes the uh, online lag a little bit more bearable at times. <clears throat> yeah, we've been doing we've been doing good lately, Tej. Lots of good streams, except Road to the Show's been Road to the Show's been uh, a little bit of a, a challenge. 
God, it pissed me off yesterday. Now here's the pitch. In the air, center field. Martin should be able to track that down. He does. Two outs, third inning. So if you guys have missed any games over the last little bit, um, I think four, five, six, seven games should be uh, should be on YouTube tonight. Bob, Bob, oh my God, that's so funny though. <laughs> we'll leave that right there. <laughs> Literally died. Literally died when I saw that comment. And that one just missed outside. Uh, but you have to get a little bit closer to the plate than that. That's that big sweeping slider. If it was a little closer, you might get a swing. Two balls and two strikes. That one's gonna live on for a while, I think. Swing and a miss of the fastball. They can't catch up to it right now. Mancini strikes out. End of the third. Zim's rolling. Only one hit allowed by Jordan Zimmerman through three. The double down the line that broke physics. Bob 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 does not exist. Only in our in, only in our dreams. Shit! And the inning begins. All right, I need to see pitches. Fucking 23 pitches in the third inning is unacceptable. Back-to-back so -back Monday off days. That is okay. Two more with the Royals after this one. Three with the... Or two more with the Orioles. Then the Royals come into town. Off day before we have a series in Pittsburgh. Ready for another chance. Leonis God damn, we got to get him this bat going. I mean, he can't. We can't have Leonis Martin leading off games much longer if he can't. If he can't hit. If he cannot hit, a headshot in Fortnite. Man, we came so close to that win last night, guys. I wasn't streaming last night, but uh, but me, Jeff, uh, Austin were playing some some night of forts. I don't know. I don't know how I I got shot uh, to end that game. I got shot through a damn staircase. Gotta add bow pins. There's a there's there's also a guy named Bo Funk as well. Leonis Martin is literal booty hole. He's gonna bat it. zero point five zero on the year. Like, how many hits does he have? I can't tell. He has four hits in 44 at-bats. Why is this guy having so much success against us? And lined right to Machado. Oh, it's going to be one of those. <sighs> like the lamp at for NHL 19, I am 100% behind that. Because the the Red Wings franchise will be back next year. I know I didn't uh didn't we didn't get very far into it this last year because I um took a whole uh, you know two two and a half months without streaming. But we, it'll be back next year, and I truly want to get a Pistons franchise to you guys. We started one this year, and then the same thing happened. Manny Machado on base for the second time. Just a little bloop single to center. I don't have a podcast command set up yet, but I did see that link. Um, you can send it to me as well. And uh, I can get that podcast command in there. 
Oh, we're lucky on that. I would say the pitcher would tell us up here that that wasn't great execution, but he definitely had <laughs> That is a pitch. Yeah, that's a that's a great place to throw a pitch to Chris Davis. That too. Yeah, great spot. Great one. That nearly would have got them on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. Oh, Jesus. In the dirt. Oh, we got him. We got him. Woo! Machado's out. Trying to advance. Fouled off. Ooh, oh, oh. bare hand pick. Can I throw a pitch? Yeah, there we go. Gets Chris Davis looking. Can't believe he didn't swing at it. Oh, God. 57 pitches here in the fourth inning is not uh, not a good time. We uh, we really do need to, we need to be better. I <laughs> can't wait to see uh, Jorge Soler. I do. Oh, come on, McCann. Make the easy throw. We are going to lead the league in errors. And they're all going to be throwing errors. Every goddamn last one of them. Uh, slider low on Adam Jones. Let's see if we can get him here. One and two. Haven't uh, used the curve yet today. Here it comes. Ah! Ah! Oh! Pretty standard curve in the dirt looking for a strike out there, but that was a good job of In the air left field, Jacoby Jones moonwalking a little bit. But that'll end the fourth inning. Still, no runs. Fourth inning. This is going to be like that Yankee game. Or that, no, it was the Cleveland game. It was, uh, we had no runs till the winning run in the 11th. Cabrera stands in, one of two hits for the Tigers on the day. I would feel bad for Tigers fans too, because I feel bad for myself. Because our team is, uh, shit. Oh, uh, come on, hang it. Hang it, hang it. Nope. God, who is this guy? Jeffrey Ramirez. Huh? 2-0. Does he make the mistake? No. Oh, we held up. 3-0. Do it. I dare you. He didn't. So we'll be taken here. Oh, fuck off. You can't give him that. There we go. Ball four. <sighs> Miguel on base for the second time. Can't see the stream? Why can't you see it? Oh, yeah, right. She probably, yeah, she probably can't see. <laughs> I got it. Made the connection now. No, man, we're used to we're used to success. High in the air for Nick. Not deep. It's actually pretty deep, but Miguel Cabrera will have to, ret have to retreat. No, we're used to success, man. You know, the Pistons... For, for the middle part of the, you know, 2004 to 2000, really eight. I mean, they were they were always there. Red Wings making the playoffs every year. Tigers are making the playoffs every year for a little bit of a stretch. Hit hauled hard by Victor, but again, just a deep fly ball. Last time a Detroit team was actually successful. Um... It was probably the Tigers, like 2013. Um, you know, the Red Wings were on the decline then. Pistons were, were shit. Lions were what they were. 
Um, probably the Tigers. Uh, the last Jim Leland coached Tigers in 2013, I would say. I would say that was the last time this team was successful. Because that team should have that, that team blew its chance at going to the World Series. Absolutely blew it. I I contest that they should have they should have beat Boston. I think they were better than Boston that year. Three and zero on McCann. At least we're seeing some pitches finally. It'll be forty pitches here. And that is up and in, two on, and two out. Not getting Tigers there this year? Eh, you never know. Baseball is a crazy sport. If they can't, Not if they can't beat Cleveland. I don't care if they beat everyone else in this division. Uh, if they can't beat Cleveland, it's not going to, they ain't even going to do anything. Yep, McCann recovers from his air. Nobody picked him, so that's irrelevant for the day. Oh, my God, he can't throw strikes. Well, let's see if he throws a fastball down that Jacoby can handle. 3-0. And, oh. and he's in danger of walking the two hitters here. You could get your bases loaded with Iglesias. Just a, a couple innings later than you predicted it before. Jacoby Jones! Three-run home run! Okay! I was not expecting that. He did throw a fastball up, and we did time it well, but even with Jacoby Jones having a little bit of power, I did not expect that one at all. Well, it only took four innings, but a 400-foot shot by Jacoby Jones. A no-doubter. Ball murdered. Hacks and steroids. <laughs> I mean, no, you can't, you can't say that. Any big league hitter is going to be capable of taking that ball out. Oh, it's not going to get through. And Jose Iglesias will ground out to end the inning. But Jacoby Jones, Jacoby does it. Jacoby hits home runs. He's not he's not all that big, but he does hit some home runs. He's got uh, he's got a quick bat. When things are going well for him, he didn't have a good year last year because he was hurt and never really got got back into his. <clears throat> into his rhythm. Disappointed in Jose, got to sleep. Hey, I don't blame you. Oh. Great view of not Ron Garden higher there. Good slider there by Zim. Starting to get a feel for that pitch again. We were kind of struggling there, second, third inning. We're getting it back here as he gets... Oh, down the line. They're going to call that a fair ball. It's only going to be a single, though. That ball, I, I must have bounced once. What happened here? Oh, that was so close. How close was this? This was almost foul. Right off the chalk. I'll uh, I'll do I'll do my best to get Jose some points for you. I have a feeling three runs is not going to be enough. Oh. What did I just say? Two run home run for the Orioles. Colby Rasmus, 
turned on that. I think it was a slider. Third home run of the year. Maybe I jinxed my myself on that one. Maybe, just maybe. And at 71 pitches, we ought, we ought to think about taking Zimmerman out. 417 foot, no doubter for Colby Rasmus. Launched deep into the seats and right. At least entertain the thought of getting the bullpen up. We can get uh, Buck Farmer and fifth inning, Daniel Stumpf. Because ideally, we'd like Jimenez, Wilson, Green there. And that'll bring up the catcher, Chance Cisco. And he'll take a Chance look. Cisco now for the Orioles. Swung over a changeup. Gotta, it's important to recover here. Really, really is. To get another inning or two out of Zim would be really, really big. It'd be hard hit right to Nico Goodrum on to first base. Easily retires. Cisco. Top of the order now, Austin Hayes. Not really sure why they have this guy batting leadoff. I really don't know. But uh, I'll take it. He, he seems like a pretty easy leadoff hitter to retire. But then again, we just got homered off by Colby Rasmus. Oh, come on, Blue. Stop it. Bloop. Yep. <laughs> that was no, no, no blooping happen, happening there. Fouled off. And Hayes will see another pitch. See if we can get him fastball up here. Full count on Trey Mancini. This is probably going to be the last inning for uh, Zimmerman. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Hayes sits down. Two outs here in the fifth. 82 pitches for Jordan. Ah, left that slider way up. And I mean way up. Austin's turning into like Steph's dad. Like, did you finish your homework? Me, me and Austin both were like, hey, did you finish your homework today? Another ball hit hard the opposite way. And now they extend the inning for Manny Machado, which is the exact last thing that you want to do with a tired pitcher. Manny Machado up the middle, base hit. And it's slow rolling. They're not going to advance the runner to third. Now two on, two out for Chris Davis. Let's uh, mound visit here to get Zim. A little bit of a breather. But Manny Machado was three for three. My mom was talking about doing her taxes. Um last night day before the uh, deadline today's the last day uh to do them and uh she was sorry she then mentioned her brother dan who uh apparently was practicing his procrastination skills and waited until today to do them chris davis two on two out and i missed with the slider because of course 2 0 on Davis. Come on, let's get a strike here. I'm not pitching all that bad right now. This is his last batter, regardless of what happens. Really you. 
Just for once, I'd like a strike on those. In the air, we're going to get out of it. Jacoby Jones underneath it. And that will end the inning. But bases loaded and a two-run home run for Colby Rasmus in what was a lengthy fifth inning. And Jordan Zimmerman's last. Why is my stream deck just nothing? Shut up. There we go. I only pressed the button seven times to silence my phone. Come on. <sighs> Why? Like, now, now my stream deck is just off? I don't even know. I don't even know. I'll be right. Be right back.
Well, <laughs> I had to move my car. Oh, that was great. <clears throat> Can't wait to rip this mask off. Well, there's there's one thing. First pitch coming, okay, back. <laughs> I don't know how long I was gone. Not long. Five minutes, maybe. Uh, unknown on that Austin, by the way. Unknown. I'll figure it out. Hey, look at that. We come back. We lead off the inning with a single. Solid. Here is Leonis Martin. Here comes the first pitch. Swing and a little tap. I don't really help myself out with Leonis Martin either. Like clearly, I'm swinging at, at pitches like that. I mean, come on. Pitch out. What are you doing? No, we cannot all do fake face masks together. No, no. Big old no. It's like he hits everything a mile in the air. Everything off his bat is is a fly ball. It's a fly ball. It's a chopper. It's nothing even competitive. I don't know. Contact or uh, uh, swing timing, good. Contact result, okay. Maybe his contact rating is just awful. That's probably that's my guess. Of course, that pitch doesn't get called uh, when I'm on the mound, but it does when they uh, when they're pitching. Go figure, eh? Get down. Okay. This inning is going about as bad as you could predict it. <sighs> you would think against a three pitch pitcher, I would be better. Why am I swinging at Garbage Day? I, it, it's 0 and 2. He hadn't even come close to the zone. Has not even come close. I can't believe they even threw that down. They had no chance of getting us. And he'll make it into scoring position here with two away, as that'll be scored a wild pitch. Surprised I didn't swing at that one too. Drives it out to deep right center field. Jones is after it. He gets there to make the <sighs> drives it out to deep center field, and it's just a can of corn. <laughs> I mean, like, <laughs> I'm not sure what the, why the uh, why Maddie V was getting so excited on that one. Oops, I'm still pitching. With, see what happens when I take like a five minute break in the middle of a uh, stream. I just uh, my game my game is completely disrupted. Um, against the righty, I'm gonna bring in Buck Farmer. And depending on who we have coming up in the inning, I may I may stick with Buck the whole time. Good thing about Buck is that he's essentially a long reliever. So he could go an inning and still be good for tomorrow. 3-2 game, sixth inning now. And Tim Beckham stands in. I feel like he his command is a little bit better right now than Zim's was. 
Like, I just, I, my off-speed stuff, I felt like, was just going wherever the hell it felt like. I really couldn't pinpoint any bit of accuracy there. And Beckham strikes out for a strikeout of the day for Buck Farmer. Hell, we might even, might as well save uh, Joe Jimenez if we can. Oh, wow. Great call there. Yeah, if we can save Joe Jimenez and get two innings out of Buck, that'd be that'd be big time. Way out in front on a slider at 81. Tough to make contact on that. Fastball up is the only pitcher that I feel like he doesn't time up well. Now I can't throw the slider either. Okay, three and two. What up, straight shot? Welcome. Good battle here. This will be the seventh pitch coming up. I mean, we were asking for that. I literally threw. I literally threw the same pitch, same spot. Colby Rasmus has a couple hits on us. The big one being the home run that made this a three-two ball game. The only real mistake we made today. Where did this wind up? Uh, he was just out in front of a uh, pitch. It's exactly where I wanted it. I thought I might have hung it a little bit. But that is not the case. Oh, come on. Why do we make things so easy for them with two outs? Why is everyone hitting the ball the opposite way as well? Like, the O's are dotting us up. I mean, Bucks got to get Bucks has to end this right now. Cannot, cannot, cannot let this inning continue. Come on, Martins, throw home. It's a dot, and he's gonna be out. Why did they send Colby Rasmus? Oh my gosh, it's about the first positive thing Leonis Martin has contributed all season. Great throw from center to keep this game, or keep our one-run lead. Uh, Nick Castellanos is 0 for 2. That makes him 1 for his last 19. I mean, that's so crazy. We, we got off to such a hot start with Nick. That one, I see that. That I don't get. <sighs> I'm just, I'm just on top of it. He, he just sucks right now, to be honest. No other way to put it. I can't make solid contact on every, on anything. I foul everything off with Nick. I just don't understand. Inside with the changeup. I mean, I, I, we what was he batting? Like near 400 to start the year, and it's just been nothing the last three series. Oh, we're fortunate there. And that's about the first time Buck Showalter could actually complain all day. And even still... All that for a ground out. Oh, for three for Nick. It's just the struggles with him are unreal. That's going to be a fly ball. Left field. Got to drop. Base hit. Taking the ball the other way with Victor seems to be working. One on, one out. Michael Givens warming up for the Orioles in their bullpen. Standing in now, James McCann. McCann rips that one well foul. Deep down the left field line. This has plenty of carry, and it's deep and away foul. 
McCann 0 for 1. He walked in this game. Also has a throwing air. Got to swing it on the changeup that just floats there for a minute. How's my day gone? Well, I slept most of it. Uh, I work uh, this uh, evening. But uh, getting on for some franchise before that. Oh, Victor might be out. No, nah, he'll be fine. Not often, not often you see Victor Martinez sliding in like that. Wild pitch there for uh, Martinez. One on second, one out, sixth inning. Uh, insurance run would be lovely here. here he comes on a ball and, two strikes. and he got me swinging with a change. That change is so, so slow. It just sits there in the zone forever. 78 miles an hour. It's almost not fair. Two out. And Jacoby Jones, who hit the three-run home run, stands in again. And that changeup is just impossible. Even that time, I'm, I'm on that. Can't hit it. On the ground, third base side, Tim Beckham. And that will end the six. So again, we're stranding base runners. We're asking for trouble. It's going to be Buck Farmer back out to the mound. Baltimore with nine hits today. Just seems crazy. Late innings in game one. A weird game. One of the rare games where we get out hit. Zimmerman was not able to go deep into this game. Allowed two runs on a home run to Colby Rasmus in the fifth. Turned out to be his last inning. And Buck Farmer will be asked to pitch the seventh as well. Going through the heart of the Baltimore order. We will get, I, I'm going to get Jimenez up anyway. Ah, come on. We can't do this to ourselves. 3-0, and oh, Really? A four pitch walk. Uh, he's, it, it's Come on. We're mound visiting to get Jimenez as ready as we can. It's Here comes the first pitch. We're lucky on that one. Didn't I didn't time that one up well. Nice job by the pitcher right there to establish himself back into the strike zone. He went to strike anyway. Make it their 10th hit, and we have problems here in the 7th. Manny Machado is 4 for 4. Why is it that we have these guys that we just can't stop? Every series. And it's always game one. Whit Merrifield went 4 for 5 against us. He dropped it. Get the ball to... Come on, get the out. There we go. <sighs> fortunate. Absolutely fortunate that we're able to even recover and get it out there. It's like, come on, di you, 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 what you diving for the ball if you're not going to get it? You're able to stop it. Then just get to, and you got to get it. It's, there's no way around it. This is his last batter. I'm, I'm sick of Buck Farmer. Send him down to fucking double A. He's got command. He's got good command for about five pitches, and then just falls apart. Yeah, fucking lucky. That should have been a three-run home run. Here comes the 
tying run from third. And a relay home. Run scores and this game's tied. We absolutely did that to ourselves. Yeah, Farmer's getting tired. He's done. Absolutely useless pitcher. Get him out. Send him, to, send him down, to be honest. Let's get a real bullpen pitcher in here in Joe Jimenez. Pitcher that can actually do decent. Can actually throw the ball. With a little bit of command. On to first. Inning over. Ay, ay, ay. Shouldn't be this hard. I mean, Zimmerman was awful. Farmer was awful. We're lucky to even be tied, to be honest. And it's def. Oh, here's the loss. And the loss to us right now. Here's Darren O'Day and his sidearm bullshit. I can't hit this. You literally have put my kryptonite into the game. For the love of the Tigers' bullpen, that's right. Three-run home run by Jacoby Jones. Two-run home run by Colby Rasmus. And a gift of a run to the Baltimore Orioles in that inning. An absolute gift. Walk, Manny Machado. Fly ball. It was that easy. Fly ball. I'm hitting down on the baseball. Why is it still getting popped up? This is literally like what the what is the point of directional hitting if when I hit the ball down it's still gonna get popped up? Well, I'm swinging down on the baseball and I'm still and I'm still popping it up. Makes no sense. First pitch on its way. That's a line drive right to center field. Two hard hit balls to center. This is gonna be a 15 inning game, isn't it? Might as well play 30. It might as well get this guy out of the lineup because he's useless. 088 on the year. If he's, I'm going to pinch hit for him next time if he doesn't get a hit right here. I mean, straight up. I, I can't hit with this guy. He's garbage. I'm going to start Victor Reyes pretty much every day over this guy. Victor Reyes is at least a switch hitter. <sighs> we can never make it easy on ourselves. Come on! We've gifted him. Gifted him two strikes. That's about the hardest hit ball, hit ball Martin has all year. Two and two on Leonis Martin. In the air, shallow. Every time. Absolutely every single time. It's a fly ball off the bat of Leonis Martin. It's just, it's It's annoying. And then we get that. And then we get that. Come on. Slider misses by a mile because this game is timing system is garbage. Doesn't mean anything. Oh, look, time of oh, good pitch release. Oh, let's throw this ball to the side. Let's throw this ball a foot away from where it's supposed to be. 
And now it's Colby Rasmus. Hit the home run to make it a 3-2 game at the time. And he goes down. <sighs> at least Joe Jimenez has come in and stopped the bleeding because really 10, 10 hits through, what, six innings was, was way too much. We could still be ahead in this game. If it wasn't for that walk. A four-pitch walk. What an uncompetitive at-bat that we had with Buck Farmer to lead off the sixth. Although Lord knows we won't be able to Won't be able to score runs, and this game is going to be over. Baltimore is going to win it in some despicable way. Five hits through seven innings is not good enough. And it's Brad Brock. Third game. He's pitched three innings exactly. For whatever reason, has not succeeded against right-handers. Hopefully we can take advantage of that here. Three or two, three, four. Candelario, Miguel. And Nick. What a time for Nick Castellanos potentially to get going. I just got our bullpen back in order. I really don't want another extra inning game. We really cannot have one. We've pitched, we, we've done like three, three in the last, I don't even know how many. Nine pitch inning. Well, Jimenez needed it. <sighs> what a joke this game is! He gets him back in the in the at bat. It should be three and zero oh right now. And it You change at bats with calls like that. Next up for Detroit, Miguel Cabrera. It was a fly out for 3 and 0 is a whole lot different than 2 and 1. If that's a 3-0 pitch, I watch it go by. Almost a worm burner as he misses on a low fastball. Come on. This is going to be a nine pitch inning? No. And he hit Miguel. Not really sure what that was all about. Right off the elbow. Hopefully he's all right. And here's Nick Castellanos. God damn, we need to get you going. You are one for your last 20. I mean, I, I I don't even know if we've ever been that bad with anybody other than maybe Leonis Martin. Four hits for Martin on the year. 2-0. and well, bottom eight wouldn't hurt to get Shane Green up. Get Alex Wilson. Actually, no. Sit Wilson down. Warm up Green. And then give me Verhagen as well. You know what? No, that's stupid. That is absolutely stupid. Wilson. It'll be Wilson if we uh, don't score a run. Shane Green if we do. Oh, yeah, yeah, I was a mile late on that. Lord knows it's just a uh, 
That's just a line drive to center field, even if we do time it up. Right back up the middle. No. No. Absolutely no way. Are you kidding me? Manny Machado is destroying us. Absolutely destroying us. I mean, Jimenez was rolling. Let's uh, let's I, I let's let Jimenez keep it uh, keep going here in the game. Come on, can I time up pitches today? That one wasn't even all that bad. Time it up. It's still out of the zone. I mean, come on, Tigers bullpen. This ball is right here. Oh. That ball misses. It's a walk. And we hadn't been able to control a slider with anyone, any pitcher in this game up until Jimenez. This is Trey Mancini. And here's the big right-handed power threat, Trey Mancini. As the fastball is swung on and missed, good location down at the knees for strike one. I'm set with the 0-1. Two-seamer way higher than I anticipated it being. Timing misses by a fraction of a second. Pitch misses by about the old foot. <laughs> nope, never mind. We can't throw a good slider with any with any pitcher today. On a consistent basis. Jimenez with four strikeouts already. Can we strike out or even retire Manny Machado? Two outs here in the ninth. Okay. Get him. Just, just put him on. I don't even care anymore. Lord knows if we throw him a, if we throw him a pitch, they're gonna pinch run some guy named N Engelb Velma. What? And now it's Chris Davis. Both righties in the bullpen. Twenty-nine pitches in. Let's go with Alex Wilson here. He's been good on the year as well. A little bit uh, better against righties than lefties, but we didn't have a lefty warming up in the bullpen. Otherwise, I probably would have gone with him. Maybe not, though. The only left we, lefty we have left uh, other than Daniel Norris is uh, Daniel Stumpf. Two-seam fastball in there on Chris Davis. On the ground. Good play, Miguel. <sighs> we will go to the bottom of the ninth with a chance to walk it off. If not, 
We will go to extra innings, but this team has not been able to hit in the mid to late innings today. It's just been, we've had five hits for about the last five innings. Whoever the hell Engelb is will play shortstop. Manny Machado is out of the game. And Victor Martinez stands in. The last guy we want to see, Zach Britton, is warming up. You've got to be kidding. You have got to be kidding. That has to be a home run. Instead, it's just a fly ball. I should have had that last one. That's off the end of the bat. That's the sweet spot right there. Nothing. Britain and Donnie Hart in the O's bullpen. That's just discouraging. You can't time a bull up any, any better than that. And especially with the wind blowing out to right field, that should be a home run. Somebody put butter on the bat or what? Two and one now on McCann. I have been calling the splitter, trying to guard against it the entire time. I, I, I move up. I swear the game knows your guest pitches. The pitchers know your guest pitches because they hardly ever throw it. You can guest pitch the uh, same pitch in one spot the whole, the whole damn day and you'll never get it. Then as soon as you move away from it, oh, look there. Just saw a slider, or a slider yet. Yeah, we were late on it. Low with the slider again. It is a full count. Jacoby Jones, who does have a home run today, on deck. Hit hard. McCann. There we go. Base hit. First hit in what feels like a century. And even then, it's just weak contact. Just did get over the head of the infielders. And now Jacoby. Been hitting the ball well in the early part of the year. Three-run home run today. Can he win it? One out, one on. Off the plate, splitter away. Bizarre first pitch. <sighs> Big spot here, 2 0. Let's see if he thinks he can get away, get away with one. 3-0. and oh. Could push the winning run to second. See if he challenges us. We're taking. 3-1 and one on Jones. I'm going to keep waiting until he brings one up. Ball fouled off. <sighs> Just early on it. Ball ripped. And that is going to get down. All the way to the wall. That's going to win the game. Jacoby Jones with a double. 
And it does! McCann scores! A weird route to the ball by the left fielder, and we walk it off. There's your player of the game right there, no doubt. All four RBIs today. Oof. He just, I, he thought he could cut the ball off, and he didn't, and it goes to the wall. It's just, you can't make that mistake. And on a day when our pitching didn't really back us up, the offense does. Four runs on seven hits. Three runs on ten hits for the O's. And Jacoby Jones gets a very, very strange-looking Gatorade bath. Yeah, baby. Good stuff right there. Really, really good. Uh, I knew this game wasn't going to go to... I, I, I really didn't want this game to go to extras. I hated that I even have to, had to use as many bullpen pitchers as I did because we bring Buck Farmer in, and he wasn't effective once he hit his second inning. Jimenez I went 29 pitches with. We had to bring Alex Wilson into the game to get it out. He should be fine for tomorrow. And then we don't have to use Shane Green, which is a big-time, big-time plus for us.